Hey guys, pets are becoming a big part of our lives nowadays, but did you know that having a dog can actually have quite the environmental impact? If you're just joining us, uh, I'm Danny the Traveler and this is Rocky the Traveler. Of course, we also know that uh, traveling in itself can have quite the big impact on the environment. But there are ways that we can do both of these things together while being kind to the planet. So check out these five quick tips for sustainable pet travel. This includes using reusable containers when packing food for your pup, using eco-friendly dog bowls, sustainable dog toys. You can even consider making your dog their own toy from recycled materials around your home. Do-it-yourself toys can definitely be more kind to the environment and gives them something to do while they're in the car or in their accommodation. Of course, try to skip the plastic toys when possible. And if making your own toy isn't feasible, look into toys made from recyclable or environmentally friendly materials. Keep this sustainability in mind when bringing other pet products on your adventures like dog beds, dog blankets, water bottles, and dog clothes. There's loads out there made from eco-friendly materials. I did mention food earlier, and if your dog eats meat, you can look into using more low-impact meats such as chicken, turkey, or even fish but try to avoid beef or other meats that have an enormous impact on the environment. Also, if possible, try to bulk buy and then pack their food with the previously mentioned reusable containers rather than buying small individual packaged or canned dog food as the packaging can be harmful to the environment. As for dog treats, I think the best way to approach this is to look into how to make, uh, how to bake uh, dog treats on your own. There's loads of resources on how to make your own dog treats and again, you can use the aforementioned reusable containers to store them. When you're out and about traveling at some point, your dog will have to, of course, go poo-poo when nature calls. There's ways to get rid of poo in an eco-friendly manner. Avoid using plastic bags as it will only add to the massive landfills of plastic bags where it takes forever to decompose. Instead, opt for a biodegradable bag. There's tons of them online and just one look, you can find many for very good deals. If you're out on an adventure in the wilderness with your dog, then you can actually bury your dog's poop. But be sure to dig a hole about six inches deep before chucking it in there, of course, without a plastic bag. Another tip to be friendly to the environment, if you're out in the wild, don't let your dog poo near the river. Almost goes without saying, but I thought I should mention it. I also think I should squeeze this into the dog poo section. If your travels include camping, be sure to leave nothing behind except for good memories. Actually, don't, don't leave the good memories behind either. Bring those with you too. Take everything with you and dispose of things in a responsible way. Be mindful of transport. Over in the US, going traveling with your dog usually means going in a car as public transport may not always be available and walking or hiking to the destination is probably not an option. So it can be challenging to avoid using a car while traveling with your dog. And I know this is difficult for many nowadays, but if possible, opt for a fuel-efficient vehicle, if possible. But if you happen to be in a place where there is public transport, check to see if they accept pets. I know in Europe and in the UK, using public transport to travel in between cities with your dog is definitely an option. So if you had the choice between taking a car or taking public transport, opt for the more eco-friendly choice. If you must travel by plane, do a bit of research and check out which airlines are considered to be the most fuel-efficient. Once you manage to reach your destination, try to stay in locally owned accommodations, pet friendly, of course, locally owned restaurants and shop locally owned. Of course, there are plenty more things you can do to be kind to the planet while traveling with your dog. But these are just some of the actions you can keep in mind when going on your next dog friendly adventure. Thanks for watching and we will see you on the next adventure.